What is up, guys? Lonely Savage here, playing some uh, PBE, until the end. League of Legends, uh, the champion Yasuo, who was released a couple hours ago. Um, high DPS, uh, attack speed based, um, auto attack based champion, who's, uh, I guess he was designed for the mid lane, because, see, I'll read you his skills here. We'll just go over, we'll do a preview of the champion right away. Alright, you start with his Q. So that's how strong it is. Alright, we'll just go, yeah, whatever they sell us to do. Never we'll head up to top lane, place. get more kills that way. It's just bots. I'll talk about his skills, do his uh, emotions, and we'll see what's going on here. Alright, Steel Tempest. Um, this, this is a really, really strong attack. Uh, the damage is not its not just that good early levels, but after you build attack speed, it gets pretty ridiculous, and I'll tell you why. Alright, so he um, it's like... Here, I'll show you. Like that. It's uh, like a short range. There's the range on it. Um, in the direction the he's facing. Um, it's uh, kind of a little cooldown, about 8 6 seconds, level 1. On hit steel, Tempest grants attack a stack of Gathering Storm for 10 seconds. Um, so you get two stacks, and then you can send out a projectile that can land. Here, I'll just ping it right here. It lands about that far away. It's a knockup. And uh, his ultimate's pretty hard to use, and I'll explain that in a minute. I'll try and use it later. Um, yeah, so. Yeah, it can critically spike, strike. It, it applies slows, non hits, like red buff. So that's why I think he'll be good in the jungle. Especially with his passive. Um, if you read this, uh, moving grants, I'm at max, what, like 100 right now. Uh, next time uh, damage is done to me, um, you get uh, shield, which is uh, it's, it's pretty nice. Alright, so. Okay, while dashing. Oh, that's. that's I didn't know that. Alright, so you dash and you use it. It does a I circle combo. Okay, that's cool. It scales with attack speed. So uh, that's it's pretty ridiculous. Like once you get a, a blade of the rune king, it's like a 1.3 second cooldown. And he's good in the mid lane because um, his W removes projectiles. So like a Nidalee spear, or oh, there's a, there's a shield. A Nidalee spear will be blocked, or something like an Oriana ball. I don't know. At peace with yourself. All right, so I'm running 21-9, making sure to grab a point of frenzy. Just so the uh, the critical strikes that he has built into his uh, to his passive, guys, his critical strike chance is doubled. He is like whatever critical chance you have, it's pretty much doubled. So I guess that's kind of good here. Um, so yeah, that's why critical strikes are very important. Also, all right. So his W projects. Uh, it's a wall. Okay, and it's E is a dash. So. is no more than a luxury. And dash is, this is what's cool about the dash though. You can use it a crap ton. Cannot be recast to the same enemy for 10 seconds, but you can dash to freaking anything you want. Like, boom. Boom. I'll give you the easy boom. Way. High mobility, it's ridiculous. Oh, come on. Freaking bots. Alright, we'll just max Q first. Alright. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it here for skills. Oh, and his ultimate. I'll explain that. All right. So, like when you knock somebody up with your Q, try and get stacks on here and use the knock up on somebody. Um. Dying's the easy part. There you go. I use the, the, the you saw the wind thing there. I think you saw. It. If you didn't see, you can go back in the video. It's I didn't zoom in out very well. Oh, they didn't even hit. Yeah, so after a while, it's the knockups become ridiculous. Like, you can use it, to, like, twice, knock up, use it again, knock up. It's just ridiculous. And then you press your ultimate. It doesn't do a crap ton of damage, but... I mean, they're knocked up, and they're suspended in the air for that extra second, so... It's really it's really quite good. So I think it'll be good in the jungle. Leave me alone! The road to ruin. Knock up. That's why I think it'll be quite good in the jungle. That he can also build kind of tanky, and this will do a lot of damage. But watch your back. There we go. I'll get the W just cause. I'll try it on maybe Shibana Q or something. 
Plus on-hit effects, so... Boom, that's some health from Doran's passive. People keep running into my blade. That's nice. That's, that's really good for last hitting, I guess. You can last hit the back line nicely. The Damn it. Poor company for a long load. All right, I'm gonna go back. Go with some quick attack speed, and I'll show you the cool lower cooldown on this. Mm. <clears throat> Actually, uh, I think Shag Shiv might be better right away, early. All right, we'll get some. We'll get a zeal and uh, some boots and some more potions. This blade never gets any lighter. All right. Okay. Yeah. So it's pretty. His ultimates. It's pretty much like a like a Fjord alt, except the target can't move. It's a little cool on though, so that's that's always good. Mm. All right. Dying's the easy part. So if you just build straight damage, you don't really need armor pen. That's nice. Okay. All right, I'll do his emotes in a minute here if I have some time here. The thing about his cute doesn't have that much range. Don't start I'll finish. That's will be amazing in the mid lane though. It's like. Oh look! Boom! Q! Damage! Boom! Back out! There we go. Oh, darn it. I will follow so close. This path until the end. Oh, I just want to see his jungle clear time early. There you go, the critical. There's another critical. Fucking bait him into the bush here. Just looking for a road home. Really? Okay. Usually you can bait the bots into the tri bush here. Or something. I will not forget who I am. God, Shivana bot, just die. Come on. Hey Shivana. Oh, look at that. Rampage. There we go. Alright, well, let's see his jungle time. Just clear time. Let's see his Doran and Zeal. Some things never die. That's not bad, I one guess. Blade, one purpose. No one is promised hmm. tomorrow. It's not terrible. Oh, I wonder if I can get blue buff on top of. Oh, okay, once this is max, the shit. Top of the uh, already low cooldown. Well, that's pretty good to engage, I guess. Let's see if you have a knock up right after that. The past. Hmm. Yeah, it's not an it's not instant knock up though. It's like it's like a Janna, Air Janna, what's it called? Janna tornado. This story is hmm. not yet finished. Still, it's high da high damage. Right, thank you, Soraka. I'm bad. Don't judge me. Stay in one place. I like his voice actor. Alright, let's do his emotes while we're chilling. 
We'll go back to base. Alright, well, actually, we'll go in base and we'll do it. Alright, here's the recall animation. He drinks out of his thing. Touches his sword. Toasts. Alright. Let's do slash dance. Oh, that's cool. Or get out of the way. A sword's poor company for a long road. Alright, that's cool. <laughs> okay. So is there any other jokes? Likes his drinks. That's kind of cool. Um, sweet. It's a leaf's only purpose to fall. Well, at least on the first, that's the reference to his story, I guess. Nine seconds, that's good. Dash the same target. Oh, I didn't buy anything. Whatever. <laughs> Alright, that's that's kind of cool. Just death. Nothing serious. Legendary. I alone decide my fate. Follow the wind. Hmm. It's a nice regen with only um. Dorans. Make it quick. Damn it. Shit. I will not forget who I am. That's cool. He kind of sends it outwards, so you don't have to be right next to it when you use it. That's kind of cool. I guess that'll be kind of cool in the mid lane, but... I don't know. His jungle was, doesn't seem that good in particular. Okay. Um, more attack speed. Always good. My honor left All right, now we have 1.3 attack speed, uh, 1.6 second cooldown, and we'll get blue buff on top of that and see what happens. Because that's crazy DPS. Zero cost to cast. It's pretty neat. No one is promised tomorrow. The leaf's only purpose to fall. You're gonna am kinda fed, so I don't know if I'd have that much damage in 14 minutes. Don't start what I Damn it. Shut down. Oh the knock up's too strong. Burnout too strong. Crap. <laughs> Whatever. If that's ever. Alright, so. I guess while we're doing this, we can talk about, um, I don't know, I'd like to start a discussion on something like, uh, the new jungle, it's very controversial. Like, some people saying it's better, some people saying it's not that good, um, it depends on the champion, um, the, uh, whatchamacallit item, where is it, um, you see, gold generation, gold income, the, if both people get the face of mountain and go top lane, like two people top, two people bottom, one person middle. Apparently, it can be good. Like plus ten gold, um, and you just clear the minions like crazy. Um, yeah, I guess 
Yeah, it works. I don't know. The road to ruin People are saying it's good. Than you think. Maybe I'm wrong and it's a different item, but pretty sure that's what they're talking about. All right. Oh, well, I'm just bad at this game. So, all right. So, um, yeah. So like, junglers that I think are popular are gonna be more popular this season. Um, definitely Olaf because the Olaf jung jungle buffs are um, pretty ridiculous. Like the axes being. Um, Yeah, so you pick up his axes when they hit a wall or whatever, so it's easy to clear. Um, so she, like, after you get your blue buff, your clear is really fast, so Olaf. And Shivana's clear is already amazing, so, like, you boost the swiftness and your jungle item earn your ancient golem really early. Damn it. Um, then you can. Your quick time is ridiculous. You're super strong now. Well, you've always been super strong as Olaf, but like you're stronger now than you were just because of the uh, the buffs he had recently. Also, people are saying like the, the monsters are way too strong. Now that there's more camps. You want to? It's the the total clear time is a little slower. Um, you take too much damage. But like as Olaf, you have built-in sustain. And Shivana's clear is so fast. I don't think I don't think it's really gonna matter that much. God damn it. Uh, whatever. Um, that, uh, it doesn't really matter. So, like, some champions, like, people are like, yeah, Alistar is coming back this year. The jungle, the jungle, uh, things give you more gold. But no, a jungle Alistar is not nearly as viable as he used to be. Um, in season, he's even less viable now than he was in season three. Just because his clear is ridiculously slow, and junglers with much better clear are getting much more out of it. Um,. Like champions like Malphite who don't clear that fast are getting ki are kind of nerfed right now. Um, but champions like uh, Olaf, Shivana, Nunu even um, seem really strong just because the Nunu is usually by uh, tra the um, Sidestone, and that's like three more wards on the map or whatever. It's more wards than the other team if their jungler isn't placing as many wards. Like Lee Sin also getting a Sidestone is really gonna add to that. God, his movement speed is so fast. Some things never. Oh come on. Just death. Nothing serious. I guess that's kind of strong. I mean, it takes a while to get going, but jeez, once you once you're there, you you can do some damage. I don't know. I think he's he's not insanely overpowered. I don't think. We'll see though. I mean, the dash is just gonna be so annoying, especially for mid laners. I mean, like. I don't know. I guess since Nidalee is going to be super popular, um, I guess it'll be kind of a good counter for her. But, uh... This blade never gets any lighter. I don't know. It is not yet time to die. Out of fear. It's ridiculous. Could stay in one place. There we go. I like how it tells you on your thing, it gives, gives it like a little windy animation. When you're about to have the uh... No more kill. There we go, that's, that's a nice combo. If you're attacking one person, you go in for the for the uh, the ult after the knockup. It's a really nice gap closer, you, you hit them with the uh, the long range swirl. 
Yeah, range. An alt in. That's really nice. See what the ridiculous cooldown. Look at that. 1.3 seconds. Max max cooldown reduction there. Okay, that's 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 neat. That's neat. Oh. Yeah, so going back to the jungler, um the jungle changes. Um yeah, Lee Sin, uh Shivana, Olaf, really strong. And uh also buffs to like Evelyn. Like Evelyn the ganks with the pink ward changes. It's it, it the the ganks are just unstoppable from her. Um yeah, and then carry junglers like Riven and uh, and Rengar even, especially with the vision changes. Rengar is super powerful because the carry junglers they can get going a lot easier now. Knock up is ridiculous. So it's pretty much like a Fiora ult and nobody was knocked up. If you get a good knock up, you, I guess you can do some nice damage. Then your team can follow up on you. Oh, I can see so many steals though. Like, uh, I guess not actually. Because you need to get the third proc. Yeah, and it does deteriorate, so. I don't know. I mean, if you're in a fight, you could steal Baron or Dragon or something with that. Okay, um... It's already max cooldown. Well, I do have blue buff still. Hmm. Alright, so... Yeah, Infinity Edge for sure. Must build. I mean, you can even build tanky. Like, I guess I'll get a Giant's Belt and see. Just to prove the point here. I mean, he's in your face. He doesn't have a lot of inbuilt CC except for the, the knockup. So, he kind of does need to be a little tanky. But I mean, like the damage he already has is ridiculous though. Like slow cooldown on the Q just makes his DPS insanely high as long as he doesn't get countered with CC. Like Oriana I think is gonna be his biggest counter in the mid lane. Oh, Ryzy bot. Legendary. I will not Double die. Triple kill. There we go. See, that's that's what's strong, though. He's amazing in the lane. Just because he can do that. Uh, I guess he... Top lane, definitely. I see him top lane more than mid. Just because. Like, he's not... I don't know. People can play him anywhere. Depends on the matchup, I guess. Wave clear though, oh my god. Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Yeah, so I also think Amumu and Sajawani got a big buff with the jungle changes. Just cause uh Mumu needs some gold to get going. And being tanky, you know. No more running. Yeah, but like champions like Nasus and Nautilus and Jarvan, everybody is still gonna be viable. As viable as the, as the other champions in particular. Damn it. Wow, I'm bad. It doesn't do anything with the projectiles. Whatever. Alright, there we go. That's not even that much damage. Jeez. The sword's poor company for a long time. No, I think the damage is glitched on that. It doesn't it didn't look like it did that much damage at all. His auto attacks do way more. Yeah, definitely. A 30 second cooldown? Okay, never mind, take it back. Jeez, overpowered. That shield though is pretty good. It's like a built in static shiv. Passive type thing. Pentagon. 
There we go. Don't start what I'll finish. Yeah, that attack speed though. It's a, it's a really long auto attack range though. Like, like if you look at it, it's like it's pretty long auto attack range. That silence hurts. Oh, man. The life steal though, like you get an early vamp scepter, like boom, heal. Your team has destroyed a turret. That fiddle. Did not work like I thought it would. Legendary. Your team has destroyed a turret. Nothing serious. I'm gonna go back and get some gold and then uh, see how my damage looks at full build. I guess Armor Pen would be nice. Maw, I think it'd be really good on him. Definitely a GA. Um, we'll finish Randuin's just cause. Uh, Hydra, just cause. Hydra's a great item. Oh, man. It's all Doran's here. Zephyr! Oh my god, Zephyr. Okay, um. Damn it, you can't get. Oh, man. I don't even like Zedek Shave as an item. Like, don't hate me for it, but I really don't. Try Zephyr. Like the tenacity bonus. Oh, too good. Yeah, we'll go. We already have max attack speed though. All right, this is 18. That's 50 percent. That's too much. I already have too much attack speed. Um, yeah, we won't get Zephyr. We don't need it. We'll sell that. And um, let's get a BT. Always good with the BT. All right, good enough. Never could stay in one place. Good enough for me. You know what? Damn it. Whatever. We're just gonna home guard. Screw that. Okay, here we go. Honor is in the heart, not the name. I was expecting. I was, I was looking forward to Yone being a champion as well. His brother. His brother with a girly ass name, apparently. Man. That damage. Uh. At peace with yourself. You will be. People are gonna be complaining about the knock of the low cooldown as alt though. Yeah, you're untargetable, so good. It's good for solo. Oh shit, I can probably get a penta here or something. My honor left a long time ago. There we go. Alright, let's see if we can kill the Baron or something before this is over. Man. The damage too good. I don't even have enough for, for damn it, I only have full stacks. Do have enough down? Yeah, okay. I don't think the bots will win right away, or that fast, I mean. I hate you. Oh, I don't know if that was a. Mm, I should have probably canceled my back though. Back, can back cancellation is kind of weird though. Blade never gets Ooh, I wonder if I can do this. Oh, you can't. Never mind. You're not a fucking Lisa, and you can't dash to friendly ward. What am I thinking? All right, let's go kill. Uh, Baron. See the critical strike, granting it to bonus attack speed. That's amazing. Oh, but this though, look, 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 look. Boom! Over the wall. Nice. 
I like the Baron has a bigger health. Right now, it's easy to, to guesstimate the smite. You have a lot of buttons to spam with this champion. Alright, we'll get Baron, I guess, now. It's a lot of attack damage. 444. Okay. I'm bad. So it applies Hydra Max, that's pretty sweet. Just a bush check. Oh, damn it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me the minions and the kills, please. That's about it, I guess. Put all the chain heads and turrets down, and we'll see what uh, we can get another pent up before the game's over. I don't mean to bore you with a 31 minute unedited video, but uh. Oh my god, that life still, look at that. Five hundred life still, oh my god. Legendary. I alone decide my fate. Triple kill. Ow, ow, ow. 500? Jesus. Well. 300? God. Freaking A, dude. I didn't realize I could heal that much. I lifesteal that. Get 45%. Yeah, that's. Never mind. That's reasonable. It's going to do 1,000 damage right there, and it applies on to all of them. And I have a freaking Hydra, so it's amplifying it. Even more. Never could stay in one place. Damn it. Wow. That's kind of why Riven does so much damage. Damn it, feared fiddle. I hate you, fiddle. Wow, on the fountain. <laughs> oh, that Hydra, too good. Alright, uh, thanks for watching this Yasuo video, it's, um, it's uh, pretty ridiculous, I guess, the damages. No, but I think he'll be, um, he won't be extremely overpowered, I don't think. Alright, well that's it, uh, thanks for watching guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed. Later.